Did you know a plane was crashed purposely to see which passenger seat has the highest chances of survival? So the question is, where should I sit on an aircraft if I want to survive a crash? Back in 2012, a team of scientists crashed a plane in the Mexican desert so they could test which seat would be safest to sit in. They placed a Boeing 727 full of crash test dolls, cameras and all sorts of measuring instruments before bringing it down. The test has been originally supposed to take place in the US, but since they couldn't get permission for the experiment there, the scientists ended up having to stage the crash in Mexico. After getting about as many permits as they had, the test was able to take place on 27th April 2012, but someone had to be in the cockpit when the plane took off. A crew of six took the plane into the skies one last time before transferring the 727 to a remote control operator who was in another plane flying behind the Boeing. While having actual living people on board, the plane would probably have provided the team with some amazing information, they couldn't stay for the crashing part for every obvious reason. The entire crew parachuted to safety three minutes before the Boeing 727 crashed into the ground at 140 miles per hour, leaving it a lifeless flight for a short time before the aircraft met the ground. The impact of the crash collapsed the plane's landing gear and the aircraft itself split into several pieces. The front section of the 727 was torn away almost immediately. As for their goal of working of which spot in the plane gives you the best chances of survival, it definitely isn't the pilots and the passengers at the front as that section was torn off and wrecked, so maybe that first class ticket isn't worth it after all. Seat 7A was thrown 150 meters away from the crash, which would almost certainly have killed someone sitting in it. The experts figured out that the best places to be in the event of the crash were by the wings, as that's where the aircraft's body is strongest and near the back of the plane. They even figured out that the passengers at the back would have been so safe that they could probably have got up and walked out of the wreckage themselves without serious health problems. Besides that, dolls that embraced the brace position fared better than those sat upright who ended up with severe stress on their back. That's because the lower spine issue and the vulnerability of sitting upright and having pieces of wreckage flying around, the brace position is the best way to prevent injuries. In this test flight, the front end crashed first and took the brunt of the impact. If the back end of the plane smashed into the ground first, you do not want to be there. Passengers seated near the wings of the plane would probably survive too, the scientists determined in their tests, but they might have broken bones in the process and need some help getting away from the wreckage. Scientists were really happy with the information they received, essentially making it the most successful plane crash in history.